cool memory device that will help you with capacity and measurement. So you may already notice the big G, okay? <laughs> Here it is. G stands for gallons, all right? So if you will just watch this demonstration, there are going to be some letters inside here These Q's stand for quarts, okay? Okay, so there are four Q's inside of the G. The Q stands for quarts, and there are four quarts in a gallon. The next letter is P. Notice we're putting two P's inside of every Q. Now, P stands for pints. So there's two pints in a quart, all right? And then the next letter is C. And since there are two cups in a pint, C stands for cups, since there are two, we'll put two C's in every P. The cool thing about this is if you try drawing this yourself, you'll remember it and you can quickly sketch it out. Because if you have a question on a test that says how many cups are in a gallon, you can probably visualize 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16. Yeah, there's 16 cups in a gallon, all right? If you're asked, how many pints are in a gallon? How many peas are in the gallon? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 8 pints in a gallon. It's a lot to keep up with, but if you use the memory device, it will really help you. Mm -hmm.